What up, Jens and Jetets? It's Pulsar. <laughs> Today we're going to be doing the second to last episode of My Wife Has No Emotion. Uh, this has been a solid show, man. It's been solid. Uh, and so, yeah, I think just real quick, we'll just kind of go jump into episode 10 as a recap real quick. I think basically it was the episode where uh, Mina just went shopping on her own. And it was just very much like a little wholesome episode about her just trying to prove to the, prove that she's more capable than she thought she was. But it turns out she got lost. Uh, but everything worked out in the end, so that was cool. It was a cute episode. It was really, really cute. Because, like, it's... Because, like, anytime, like, Mina has to, like, do something on her own, you can kind of see how she's, like, processing things. And I think that's what's been, like, the highlight of the show, is that, like, she's a really defined character, right? Where she's not, like, all-knowing. She's still learning things. Especially when it comes to human, like, nature. Like, what humans want. You know what I mean? Because, like, she's basically just meant to, like, make curry. <laughs> make some meals or whatever. And it's been really fun watching her kind of just try to grow. And then and all the little quirks she builds along the way are so cool. Like, it's just it's such a good show. It's, 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 a, it's super wholesome. And, and anyways, so yeah, let's just jump into episode 11. Uh, as per usual, um, there's a playback time. That's going to be where I'm at in the episode. <clears throat> and so, yeah, I think we'll have to just go right into it. I think, yeah. Here we go. Three, two, one. Are they playing life? Hmm. Here, I'll show you. You can barely see it. What? How hard would you have to throw dice to crack glass? I guess break glass even. Hmm. Why does this guy have like this this grim look on his face? Oh, it's the opening. I haven't really hyped this. <sighs> I'm probably gonna do a once all these videos are done or uh, once we finish the whole set. There's gonna be a slight lull because the. Uh, the next season doesn't start till like October, and so we'll probably be done before then, right? We'll probably be finished before mid -Oct mid September. I'll probably do like, a review of all the shows put together that I've watched, uh, and that's that's probably my intention is to do like some like kind of not really a review, but maybe like a recommend, because I think like reviews are like a little bit, uh, you know, it's it's, it's you know it's just opinionated, right? But I mean, like I would just go like, would I recommend the show? Yeah, <laughs> no. Are probably my intentions for once this is gonna be done. So it'll probably be towards like the later end of September. That's my full intention. I'll make a nice video instead of like these reaction videos. <laughs> I mean, these are nice, right? These are wholesome. You can hang out with me and just chill. Ooh. -oh. I'm guessing the show is going to end, like, willy-nilly. I can't see it having, like, a proper full-on ending, right? Like, where something happens or something. I don't I don't know what it would do. And I, I guess I'm prepared for that. He knows a guy then, huh? Oh. Is it family? Daguma Guma. Is it Mina home? Oh, right, that's what's missing, right. Mm. 
<laughs> oh yeah, so it's the dad, okay. Okay, so you're probably gonna get the family. Or maybe it's just the dad, I don't know if the mom will show up later. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wait. That's not the father, then. <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> We're gonna ignore that sound effect I just made. What are we talking about here? There we go. I was hoping they were talking about this. Okay. Because everything seemed to just flow well for me. Okay. Okay, I could see this actually being a pretty good arc to hit then, actually. <laughs> there we go. Huh? <laughs> this is dude.
，啊<laughs> of course. I love her <laughs> emotionless face. Oh. <clears throat> That's like steady little smile on my face. <laughs> I I thought he was gonna go right up and suplex angels. I don't know why. Oh, this is probably gonna be a two part arc. Right? It has to be. Maybe. Oh snap. I'm not gonna lie, I thought she was pretty cute right there. <laughs> I was pretty sold. I was like, oh, me looking cute. I think it's because I've seen we've seen them together for so long that I'm like, alright. <clears throat> I just felt like they dodged like the bullet between like how how much of it is this actually like a, a relationship and how do how does society view it? And so I'm hoping. This this family arc will really break it down. <laughs> They're talking about manufacturers. I earned you as my privilege. Okay. I was wondering if he was gonna drive or something, but first of all, he's in the city. And an empty train? It's a lie. That's a goddamn lie. I love that outfit for her, by the way. Super cute. The sister's here too, right? Or does the sister live alone? I don't remember. <clears throat> oh yeah, she has her hair down so she can be solar powered. Oh, never mind. The highest price performance reach. <laughs> I forgot about that. She was always worried about her value.
Wait, do they not realize that she's a robot? Oh. I do appreciate that they brought him on Mori, right? They like he definitely thinks of him as his family. Like he's all in on what he has. <sighs> I think I just missed something important. Yeah, okay. I was wondering, yeah, they don't... It's like funny because it's like it's like the same face she always does, right? Without a doubt, it's like always the same face, but they like, just angle it. Such a mom thing to say. I don't know. <laughs> I think I like how he's listing her as a feature. There you go. Just say how you feel about her, I guess. Yeah, exactly. You gotta speak up your... I feel like if you think about it, he's never really had to articulate why he likes Mina, right? <laughs> they don't even discuss anything.
I just wish they had like the show spend a little bit more time explaining what it is to have relationships with robots. <laughs> oh, I love Curry, man. I miss making it. <laughs> oh wait what <laughs> you imagine being designed to be a wife oh man you know what is made to be a wife <laughs> Why is she looking up at the sky again? <laughs> That's how it is. Man, how do I feel about this? It's I, I think it's going back to how I felt like for the beginning of the show. Where it's, I just, it just needs to hit these beats just a little bit harder. And I would be so enamored with this show. Like, right now, I feel so, like, I feel so messed up because I was like, is that a, was that a good episode or not? Or, you know, or not a good thing. I think the episode's fine, right? But was it, was it just enough to, to really want me to, like, gush about the show, right? I mean, this ending gets me, though. <laughs> This ending is so good. Oh, she's smiling. She's probably smiling right there, right? Cause like, I mean, I'm gonna assume, I'm gonna see what the post credits say. But I'm thinking episode 12 will probably still be with the family, right? Or maybe not. Even not. Interesting. We'll see. Cause like, I'm still, I'm trying to think about it, right? Cause like, like I said, I want to do like a, re like a, like a recommend, right? And I, I, I'm so not sure about this show if I would recommend it. I at least want to find all the good points about this show, right? Which I think there are plenty, right? But it's just like, I'm like, please, just hit those beats. Hit those beats just a little bit harder. <sighs> 
Because, like, this one, I thought it would have been, like, a lot more interesting if there was more, like, pushback between the family about what was going on. But, shrug. <laughs> I guess not. I, it's, you know what I mean? It's what I want. But it, this is what the show is. And it's just wholesome. It wants to just be wholesome. And I get, I get it, right? It's, just, it's not fair for me to just keep ridiculing the show. Because the show knows what it is. It has a clear identity. But it's just, like, I get so, like, I get so invested. Because I think, like, they're going to just push it to that one... Just a little bit over the like the edge. Like, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. And it just never quite gets there. I mean, it does got there like with some points, like some episodes. Like I think like the psychology one was pretty good. Or like, there's there's a lot of cool beats here, right? And I got to kind of like pull all my thoughts about it for, together. But it's like, I think that a lot for me hindered on this show, right? Like on this episode specifically, like how the family dealt with it, and they were just like, all right. I was like, oh, okay, so. I, and it's hard because I don't think the show ever truly establishes what it's like to have a relationship with a robot, right? It, so because of that lacking dichotomy, it's it makes it hard to to really understand what's going like to to see if there's any like weight to what happened with Mina, right? Because like now it, now it just seems like oh it's just a very normal thing for people, and if that's the case, then what's specifically special about their relationship? Well, I guess Mina's special, but she is Mina's amazing. Anyways, um. Yeah, I don't mean, I'm not, I, I think I'm being a little bit negative, Nancy, but, you know, I just, like, look, just, I just want a little bit more, you know what I'm saying? I just want a little bit more, just a little bit more. Anyways, all right, guys, I'm going to take out, all right, take out, I'm going to peace out. I'll, I'll see you guys next week for episode 12, and then I'll start to really gather my thoughts on the whole rest of the show. Like I said, though, like, the show is pr it's, it's good. It's pretty good. It's just like, <laughs> I like how I said it good, then it's like I just downgraded it immediately. Um. Uh, it's fine. All right, guys. Take care of yourselves. Peace out.